Hello friends, today I am going to share with you how you can bypass FRP lock on Galaxy M10. So first of all, we need to connect it with Wi-Fi. So I am just giving my password over here. You need to connect it with Wi-Fi or data SIM, no problem at all. So I am just giving my password over here and connect it with Wi-Fi. Then you need to connect it with computer and open Samsung FRP tool in computer. The link is in description. You can download it from there. As you can see, I am just going to connect it. And now we need to click on the bypass FRP. Okay. And this will show a pop-up message on your mobile screen. So just click on the okay button. And if this tool doesn't work for you, you need to disable driver signature, restart PC. Hopefully it will work for you. As you can see, pop-up message appear. Just click on the view button. Now this will open Google Chrome. So just accept and continue. Click here. No thanks. And here we need to just search for FRP Facel from FaselMobile.com. So just type here FRP Facel, and you will see the first link here. Just click on it, and this will let you go to my website. So just scroll down. Here you need to click on Settings, and you can check its about section. It's M10. And Android version you can check it software information and Android 10 1st April 2021 the security patch so we just need to go back and here we need to click on the set locks screen lock this one and here you can just need to set pattern lock or pin lock so I will set pattern lock two times here as you can see our pattern lock is set it up just skip here and now you just need to go back to the home screen and here we just need to set up our mobile and this will let you bypass frp you just need to give your pattern lock which we set it up before so just click on the next button and it can take a few seconds over here as you can see we just need to give our pattern lock and this will definitely bypass your FRP lock. You can use this method on other Samsung models also, but you need to have uh, old security. So as you can see, there is skip button. So we just click on the skip button. That means there is no FRP lock at all. Just click on the next next button. Click OK and adding the finishing touches now it can take a few seconds over here so just click on the next button again just wait a second click on the next button skip skip again finish as you can see our phone is just going to start just a second done we are almost there as you can see phone started up successfully and there is no frp lock or google lock if this method works for you, please do comment in the comment section with the date so other people can also get help. As you can see, it's about section and it's software version. So hopefully you like the video. If you like the video, do subscribe, like and share. See you in the next video. Till then, bye bye.